I mean, say Warren Buffett, for example, and to be totally frank, I'm not his biggest fan, but, uh, you know, he, he does a lot of capital allocation. Um, and he reads a lot of, lot of sort of annual reports of companies and all the, all the accounting, and it's pretty boring, really. Um, and he's trying to figure out is, does Coke or Pepsi deserve more capital? I mean, that's, I mean, it's kind of a boring job, if you ask me. Um, but, uh, you know, it's still a thing that's important to figure out, like which is a company deserving of more or less capital? Should that company grow or expand? Is it making products and services that are better than others or worse? And, you know, should, you know, if, if, a, if a company is making compelling products and services, it should get more capital. And if it's not, it should get less or go out of business. Well, there's a um, big difference, too, be between someone who's making a, an incredible amount of money designing and engineering fantastic products versus someone who's making an incredible amount of money by investing in companies or moving money around in the stock market or doing things along those lines. It's it's a different mm -hmm. thing. And to put yeah. them all in the same category seems – it's it's very simple. And as you pointed out, it's an attack vector. Yeah, for sure. Yeah. Uh, I mean, I think it's, it's really – I, I do think there, in the in the United States especially, there's an overallocation of talent uh, in finance and law. Uh, basically, too many smart people go into finance and law. Um, so, you know, this is both a compliment and a criticism. Uh, we should have, uh, I think, fewer people doing law and fewer people doing finance, and more people making stuff. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> well, that would certainly be better for all involved if they made better stuff. Yeah. Yeah. Absolutely. Yeah. Um, and and uh, you know, manufacturing used to be highly valued in in the United States, and these days it's not. It's it's often looked down upon, which I think is wrong. Yeah. Well, I think that people are kind of learning that, particularly because of this whole pandemic and this relationship that we have with China, that it there's a lot of value into making things, into making things here. Yes, somebody's got to do the, r the real work. Yeah. You know, and, um, you know, like make, making a car, it's an honest day's, it's an honest day's living, that's for sure. You know, or making anything really, or providing a valuable service, um, like providing, you know, good entertainment, good information, that these are all valuable things to do. Um, you know, so, yeah, there should, should be more, more of it.